Yo, welcome back you beautiful people to yet another video on my channel on how we can enable Microsoft Copilot's AI Assistant one of the latest and greatest features on Windows 11. So in this video, I'm gonna let you know how you can do this job. So without wasting any time, let's get it straight to the point and enable this feature. So the first thing that we need to do is that we just need to open registry editor, okay? And then after that, you just need to follow this route, H key current user software, Microsoft, Windows, Shell, and then Copilot. You just have to co expand Copilot and under the Bing chat, just click on Bing chat and up in there is user eligible. Double click on it and change the value data from zero to one. A little possibility that you do not even have this Copilot fuller and that's so good and so cool. There is nothing to be worried about. Just continue the tutorial. You do not need to do anything, okay? After this, let's just continue our tutorial to this GitHub page, Vive Tool. Vive Tool, what is basically Vive Tool is, Vive Tool is a tool that lets you enable some features of Windows Microsoft that are not publicly released. All the projects that Microsoft is working behind the curtains. So in this page, we just need to click down the releases Vive Tool the version might be different and download the zip file okay just download it and the directory where we need to extract it is important okay then after that we just gonna open it and click on this extract all click on it and then do not extract it under the download folder just click on browse this pc open c folder and then windows and then scroll down to windows system 32 select folder extract in my case i'll need to replace the files in this destination and i'm all good so after this what i need to do is that and after this you will just need to open cmd command prompt and just paste these notes one by one vive tool will enable some id codes right click hit enter successfully feature set feature configuration the second one copy right click hit enter the third one and so on so i'm going to skip this part real fast So it says successfully set feature configuration. So we are all good to go. We just need to restart our PC. Then suddenly you will see that surprise, surprise, Copilot is there and is installed in your PC. So this was a fairly simple tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video if you find a value in it. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're interested in new technology tips and tricks. Take care of yourself and peace out.